the meaning if uh, Lauren Boebert, the second most popular QAnon congressperson in MAGA, what if she goes, what if she loses? And what job will she have? Because I don't even think well, shooters think exist it's... anymore. Pew, pew, I don't think shooters exist anymore. What makes well, I, I guess it, it I might know. be a it might be a gain for 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 OnlyFans. Uh, I, I don't know what she would do in this scenario, but I think that for, for symbolically to take out one of the poster child. There's a lot to unpack here in this 25 second clip. Let's start with the basics. First, that was Democratic Congressional Campaign Committee and Democratic National Committee advisor Kurt Bardella on the readout with Joy Reid making fun of what Lauren Boebert would have to do to make money if her re-election bid was unsuccessful because at that time she was losing. Well, as of this recording, she came back. She's winning. Second, to the it was just a joke people saying I guess it might be a gain for OnlyFans is disrespectful to sex work, which is legitimate. So says the average person's Google search history. And the same goes to those who say Bobert would be flipping burgers or working in drive throughs The pandemic just proved how essential that work is. Last but not least, while Joy Reid burst out laughing, look at MSNBC contributor and former Democrat Senator Claire McCaskill's face. Perfect. To be clear, I'm not trying to stress intent. It doesn't seem like Bardella was trying to be dismissive to some forms of work. And I'm not against making fun of people or Bobert in particular. We can make fun of her based on what she says and does day to day. It's just that this thing about OnlyFans could be rooted in unfounded misinformation about her being a former escort. This joke came shortly after frequent MSNBC guest Eli Misto said something similar about Bobert on his Twitter account. Wednesday morning, he said, quote, is Lauren Boebert still losing? I guess this is the lucky day of the next OnlyFans star Ted Cruz thinks should be a congressperson before deleting it after Bardella's joke aired, or I guess it's Eli's joke. Now you should know that, according to this Fox News article, Bardella is a former Republican and former Lincoln Project senior advisor, and I find it weird that current Republicans have a problem with what he said, calling Bardella a garbage person. Now hold up, leftists can say, Bardella needs to do better, but Fox News and other conservative news outlets can't, especially if they kept quiet when others made jokes or they made jokes themselves about Paul and Nancy Pelosi after he was assaulted. Anyways, the other day, Tyler the producer said that if Boebert were to win, we would never hear the end of it. She wouldn't shut up. I said, well, she wouldn't shut up even if she lost. She would just scream election fraud. Her loud mouth is her brand. Incels must love her, which is why, with all of this said, you know what? Bobert would kill on OnlyFans. Then who would be laughing? Well, I, I, I guess us still, but for Rebel HQ, I'm Jeff Wickens. My architect knows Japanese. For more from the Young Turks, stay right here. To see additional content from yours truly, click on the Jeff Wickens hashtag. You can also find me on my YouTube channel, We Gonna Be Alright. Thanks for watching.